Hey guys. Uh, so excited. Today was just a, an overwhelming day of doll happiness. Um, so many things happened that I was not expecting. Uh, so, first, uh, in the mail today, complete surprise to me from Johnny. He sent me two selfie snap Bratz dolls. Uh, the hair on these dolls is amazing. Super soft. Really good face paint. He, like me, will sit there for hours and pick out a doll's makeup or pick out a doll to make sure their makeup is perfect. Not one sign of wonk eye or messed up lips. So I got Jade and then he sent me Rhea, who is just gorgeous. Uh, favorite part on her? She has hamburger shoes. Her shoes are hamburgers. I mean, really? That is just so freaking cute. Um, so I normally and help, uh, have been an old school Bratz fan. Um, I do like the faces on these brats and I love that they have jointed knees like this. I love this this kind of jointed knee. I just wish that if they're going to go ahead and give them jointed knees, why can't you give them jointed elbows or wrists? Cuz you give them purses, but you can't make them hold them in a nice attractive way. But they are absolutely gorgeous. Rhea's hair I'm going to have to wash cuz it's kind of it's very dry. The color is very beautiful. It's soft up to here, but the like the, this part here though is very, very rough. So I'm gonna have to wash and condition it. But other than that, perfect face paint. Love, love these shoes. Ray is my favorite. Jade is my second favorite. Um, her shoes are very, they're very classic, very classic brats, I think. Um, I'm not a fan of her pants. They're cute looking, but they're they're sewn uneven. Like this one, the seam is over here, and this one, the seam's right at the front of the leg. So that's a little weird to me. But they do come with a ton of accessories. Jade came with um, a cell phone, two cases, a lipstick. A uh, necklace that says Cool Cat, a wristwatch, or a smartwatch, sorry, she has a smartwatch. A necklace, a pair of sunglasses, hashtag earrings, and a brush. And Rhea comes with a, a flamingo necklace, two bracelets, a cell phone, and honeycomb earrings. I'm not taking the accessories out right now because the accessories are a pain in the ass and they don't like to stay on the doll. And when they do stay on the doll, it messes their hair up. Bugs the crap out of me. <laughs> but other than that, they are beautiful. So, Johnny, thank you so, so much. I love them. I will, of course, keep them forever because they were a gift from you. And so, yeah. So, the other thing, guys, that I was super jazzed about is I ordered from a website called junk, the junk, or JunkieSpot.com. They're a ball joint doll store here in, in California, in, in Northern California. They're based in the San Francisco area. They carry dolls, ball joint dolls, and supplies like clothes, eyes, uh, wigs, obitsu. You can get every, pretty much everything you need there. Um, the good thing about the Junkie Spot is if you order a doll from them and you're in the United States, you're going to get that doll in about a week, week and a half, because every doll they have there, they actually ha physically have there, unless it says, like, pre-order. But I have I've been going there for, God, years, and I've never seen a pre-order there. So, the thing I want to show you guys is they have on there now... Uh, DIY eye kit and they come that's a do-it-yourself doll doll eye kit and you get them in 12 14 and 16 millimeter these are 12 so I've been playing with these all day 
I've been making doll eyeballs. So this one's all glitter. A lot of, all of them are glitter. This one is, where is it? Where's the matching? This one is actually a sticker, a jewel sticker. So you take them, you take them apart. I'll show you. They come in pieces. You have to assemble the whole thing yourself. And it, it literally takes seconds to put it together. And you can take it apart when you're done. If you don't like it, or if you want to change it, you can take them apart and swap out the eyeballs or swap out the colors. Um, I, you can use acrylic paints or what I did, because I learned this from uh, watching Asenva's video, is I use nail polish. So this is the stem and eye back. And then with that, you get, um, come, there's four pieces. So I can't take it out now, but there's a little flat piece inside there that goes that plugs into this and then onto that is where you put your paint or your decal and then you get a lens which is i don't know if you can see it there's a dome here here i'll put it near my shirt there's a dome here that's the other piece that magnifies everything that you put in there you can paint a pupil on that and then put together your eye and so then everything just plugs together like that and you can glue it or you can leave it like that so those, and then I did, here's one with a pupil I did. It's all glitter, pink glitter. That's gonna go on my big girl up top there. And then <laughs> I also used um, the Create a, Mon Create a Monster Monster High, the body tattoos that they came with. I used those to make these swirled crazy eyes. Aren't those cool? And then I have this pair that's black with glitter, and I call them galaxy eyes. And then there's one that's just uh, mostly silver glitter. It's rainbow glitter. So, you know, I, you get... All together, it makes five pairs of eyes all together. And it's uh, $19.99 to make five eyes. And if you have ball joint dolls or dolls in general you know you'll pay for one pair of eyes you can pay up to twenty dollars or more for one pair of eyes so for twenty dollars to make five pairs of eyes that's not bad that's actually great and like i said if you don't like them you can take them apart and do it over again i sat here for about i don't know hour hour and a half making eyeballs it was very fun and now I have an abundance of cool eyes and they're all unique because you make them yourself. So, comes now comes the real big reveal. I am so excited. The doll I've been telling you guys about, my big surprise doll I've been waiting for is here. It came so early. I got an email about two weeks ago that said that it should be here between uh, June 28th and July 15th and here it is July 19th I think July 18th and it came and here it is oh my god it's a Sum Zinc he is a centicorn see because he has a horn and he is a centaur how freaking awesome is this? His tail is magnetic. You could get it. I could have either gotten it. I got two different tails. I don't like the other one. The other one is like this. Looks like teddy bear fur and it's jointed. And then there's this. I love him. Look at that. He has 25 points. No, 26 points of articulation beautiful and they look at that face you can see better pictures of him on my instagram um i have pictures i put pictures up of him on my instagram i i cannot tell you guys how much i love this guy he is so awesome he really just i can't say enough about him
each hoof is jointed so you can have him like completely straight legged or all his legs are all jointed it's just oh it's doll heaven day excuse me don't judge me for drinking to that pepsi but i'm just so excited my, oh my god guys it's been such <laughs> a great day for dolls and toys for me i mean i got brats that i didn't know were coming from johnny thank you johnny love you can't believe you did that thank you so much then I got these cool <clears throat> doll eyes that you can make yourself, which, um, yeah, it's the junkie or just junkiespot.com. Junkiespot.com 12 millimeter DIY acrylic eye kit. They do come with instructions, um, but they're pretty simple to do, honestly. But read the instructions. Like Asenva said, they're really funny. Read the instructions, you'll have fun. Um, you can use any kind, any method you want to put stuff in there. Um, I would try putting beads inside the eyes though, because once you close everything up, there's very little room. Um, I would stick with paints, tattoos, or stains, um, or stickers, because in my swirly eyeballs, I don't know, you can't really see it in the background, but there's actually a star. There's a pink, pink star with blue, with a blue outline, and then the swirl. So that's a temporary tattoo, two temporary tattoos on top of each other. And then you put the, as soon as you put the, the dome on, it magnifies everything. So you have to take that into account too, that if you paint it too big, it's gonna get blown out once you put it on there. Also, another tip is let them dry. Let them dry really well. The first time I did it, I thought they were dry. I put the dome on and it just smushed everywhere, ruined the whole thing. But I started again. And that's how I got the galaxy, well, my night, my nighttime, my galaxy ones. Black background, and then glitter on top of it. I like a glitter eye. And my pink lady, like I said, she's gonna get these pink sparkle eyes. They just catch the light perfectly and make it look really beautiful. Um, yeah, guys. Um, again, everybody who who's messaged me, sent me little comments, Thank you so much. I really do appreciate everything. Um, I made that video yesterday. I wasn't trying to brag on myself at all. I was just really touched by the letters. By the letters, I wasn't trying to like self-promote or talk about how great I am or anything. I just thought the letters were really cute, and I felt I should tell you the story of why I got the letters. So, yeah. And if you guys like the video, please like subscribe um follow me on facebook just look up me by my full name josh matthews m-a-t-t-h-e-w-s or on instagram i'm under on instagram i am um well let me look i will tell you right now because i'm not very good at this um matthews 3867 m-a-t-t-h-e-w-s 3867 that's me on fall on on Instagram so if you want to please follow me on Instagram I have posted all the pictures of my of my Zoom Zinc my new Centicorn guy um, they're a lot better than on the video he looks so much better in person and they gave him these beautiful green eyes and it worked, worked perfectly because he has blue blue tipped everything so please uh, like subscribe and follow me on Instagram if you would like and I love to hear from you guys. I try to answer everything that anybody writes to me. So I hope to hear from you. Love you guys.